okay today you're going to journey with me as i put in the sink the tv the radio all the entertainment and niceties and another shot of the blue wind wow y'all i found this piece for three dollars it was three dollars at home depot because it was damaged on one side but i couldn't use that side anyway because i needed 18 inches 18 inch shelf this is eight by four feet they got the refrigerator right here thanks dad that was my that was my uh father's idea just put it right there so yes yeah, this is working out perfect this is gonna be the little tv section and uh, um a place i can put my computer at and then that's gonna hopefully be the sink just gotta put some kind of lacquer on there or something to secure it in all right all right uh today was a good good day look at that uh got this in this is here i don't need this anymore this is wedged in here now i got it wedged right here so that's into the wall that's into the van so this thing ain't going nowhere look that's me pulling that's me pulling it ain't going nowhere uh the middle part is stuck too. It was supposed to be. Not really. Um, and then this this top is fastened in. I just got a little temporary screw right here to figure out how this is going to work. This is still open because this is supposed to be my sink area. So I got to figure out what I'm going to do with that. Uh, it's looking good, y'all. I'm very excited. My blue eddy still kicking back there. Still got my blue eddy under there. Take a picture of that. I love it. Nobody feels sorry for me, man. You know, he pulled me from the road and he'd been in his hotel room for three days with mm. the lights off. He was depressed. There was things on his mind that went back to his childhood. Chilling, watching Andy. His mind went Get, to uh, rearrange my uh, lights. So now they he still had more the section out. Part inside his soul that he could never. That this had to be one of the most frustrating parts of the build so far, as you see, there's missing a radio. So I ordered this one off Amazon, and we're gonna try and get here. Let's see how this works. Okay, I figured out what I was doing wrong. I just switched this radio hook this radio up and here on the description they got it plugged up to the bottom one but the actual one you need is the top one this is for one of these little uh cheap uh chinese like uh southern radios so it worked out that way uh and then that's on the auxiliary let me see i might have made this video too fast uh So it's still not working in there, but uh, if I switch it to auxiliary, it kicks on. So that is odd. Sorry, take care. Another Saturday, another job well done. Uh, got the radio couldn't fit. I tried to scrape it out, you see, as you can see, as far as I got with that. So I gotta work on that. I put the TV in. That TV take a lot of power. So I gotta look for a more uh, low power one. Put seat belts in. <laughs> Got seat belts in. Uh, then I bolted the seats to the uh, ground. Got to fix this reflectors. Uh, Got that sink with the little drain pipe. Refrigerator in. Added another panel to the wall. Just notice I put that in backwards. So we'll see where we at. 
They're trying to get it together. All right. Not bad for three weeks. All right, so I think I got most of the major things in. I still need to get some uh, second row seats, and that's what the future video is going to be about. So please stay tuned for that. Then, uh, of course, I got to do the finishing touches, finishing uh, installation, and stay tuned. God bless.